Victor Echo 3, Echo Foxtrot, Quebec. Good evening, this is the Mandane portion of the YL system. We're looking for Chucky on Kenny 1, General Class of the Bronx. This is Kilo 4, Delta Mike Whiskey. Victor Echo 3, Echo Foxtrot, Quebec. Echo, and I bought that dress, and I did the hair, and I There you go. Here I go. QSL, QSL, QSL. I copy Kilo no, 4 wait, Delta Mike it. Whiskey. Over. But he thought that All right, Paul, I've got you about a 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two, 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 he two, 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 nasty. That's nasty. Roger, Diane. I copy you, uh, 5-7 Owen Sound, Ontario. Over. Negative traffic, just to check in, I'll say 7-3 and thank you for your time. Over. Victor Echo 3, Echo Foxtrot, Quebec. Victor 3, Victor Echo 3, Echo Foxtrot, Quebec. Uh, good evening. Roger, this is Paul in Owen Sound. I have no traffic. Just thought I would check in and say thank you for taking my call. 7-3, over. Okay, Paul, 7-3, and you have a good evening there. CQ, CQ, CQ 20. CQ-20, hello, 20 meters from W-0-J-O-V, Whiskey Zero, Japan, Oscar, Victor, State of Colorado calling CQ-20, Victor Alpha 3, Oscar, Sierra, Oscar. All right, fine business, so we're getting a beam and antenna turning your way. Okay, and signal so, picked up, uh, didn't it? Your signal came up with Farm Shine, hope mine will as well. Uh, thank you for the uh, correction, Victor Alpha there. 3, Oscar Sierra, better, huh? Oscar. So we got it now. Don't know how much of my uh, prior transmission you copied. The antenna was turned to the northwest. The name here is Steve, Sierra, Tango, Echo, Victor, Echo. Steve is the handle. My QTH is in southwestern Colorado. Running an ICOM 7600, it's barefoot to a, a three-element SIP IR Yagi at uh, about 50 feet. Back to you, Victor Alpha 3 Oscar, Sierra Oscar from W0JOV. Yeah, W0JOV. Yeah, hey, Stephen. Yeah, this is uh, Carson, Charlie, Alpha, Romeo, Sierra, Oscar, November. I'm just uh, operating portable in the woods in Ontario here. Yeah, do you mind if I uh, do a little experiment? I've got an antenna switch here. Right now I'm running uh, on a 16-foot uh, vertical and uh, I've got a 20-meter um, dipole I'm going to switch to here in a second if that's okay with you. Yeah, fire away Carson, be glad to give you a report. You're right at, uh, uh, right at S9 with your present antenna, so nice signal into uh, Colorado, go ahead. Okay Stephen, now I'm on the dipole and uh, yeah, I'm still on the dipole now, and I've turned my power down to uh, 5 watts. Uh, do you copy me? Over. I do copy, uh, Carlson, and okay on your uh, QRP rig. I can't tell, uh, there's no noticeable difference, at least here, Carson, between the 16-foot uh, vertical or the 20-meter uh, the, uh, dipole. So your Q5 on uh, both of them. And uh, maybe as we carry on here a bit, I can, uh, can give you a little bit more feedback. But right now, I can't uh, really you tell the difference. QRP in the vertical? Yeah. So, uh, wonder where you're located in Ontario, and I think you said you're operating portable, so I gather maybe it's uh, in a park or a camping area or something like that. But, uh, but nice copy. I'm in southwestern Colorado, Carson. 
I'm about 65 miles from the uh, state of Utah, about 125 miles from the state of New Mexico. We're in a high mountain valley. The elevation here at the shack, uh, Carson, sitting on my desk is 6,000 feet above sea level. Wow. So I guess that would be about uh, perhaps 1,900 meters. So I think it's downhill most all the way from here to uh, Ontario. <laughs> Line of sight. But I don't know if that yeah, uh, around, matters in the uh, radio. I think that park world. that I was at. Back to you. Victor yeah. So yeah, he's a lot higher than yeah, hey, Stephen, I hope you can hear me. I'm now on QRP on uh, uh, the vertical antenna. But yeah, um, yeah, I'm in southwestern Ontario. Um, my main um, enjoyment in the hobby is operating portable. I do like operating QRP, but I also have a little amplifier. I... Uh, like running on lipo batteries but uh, today i have a just a lead acid battery the place i'm operating portable isn't a very long walk so i can bring a bit, bit of extra weight but when i don't want to bring extra weight i have uh, lipo batteries and uh, they seem to work pretty well for me yeah i uh, am putting up my antennas today with a telescopic pole uh, i've got a 30 foot telescopic pole for um, the 16 foot vertical and then a uh, my friend who's with me also has a 30 foot telescopic pole and they've used their pole to elevate the uh, dipole to about uh, 16 to 20 feet. Anyways, I hope you're reading me. Uh, yeah, Carson, VA3 uh, OSO. Hi, this is Carson. Copied almost all of that. There is some QS Baker. Well, fine business again on uh, your being QRP. And uh, I think you said about seven oh, watts. You can correct me on that on the next over. Yeah. And uh, here we're running uh, just barefoot. So, uh, Victor Alpha 3, Oscar Sierra, Oscar, but they did their own thing. Yeah, Stephen, uh, you just dropped out uh, the 400%, but uh, I can still hear you in there. Hopefully you can hear me. Thanks for the contact. Really appreciate it. Uh, W0JOV, uh, this is Victor Alpha 3, Oscar, Sierra, Oscar, 73. No? I was W0JOV. I lost most of that. So uh, I'll say 373 to you, Carson. Yeah, no, and, uh, thank you for responding to my speech. That's why it's good. Uh, Victor Alpha, oh, coming back Oscar, up. Sierra, Oscar, portable. From um, W0JOV.